Dancers Hall Theatre has this week been the focus of debate with a street art mural by UK artist Ben Ein. The words, that's entertainment, minus the apostrophe, are now splashed on the facade, something that has seen opposition from some quarters. The artist, who has local connections, was keen to kickstart the government's urban regeneration programme. The way that I work is I don't really kind of mock anything up. I like to turn up at the wall, have a look at it, get some kind of feeling, get some kind of inspiration, uh, look at the wall, look at the people that are going to look at the wall, look at the people that are going to view the wall, the history of the building. And uh, this building has a long history of entertaining people and that's entertainment fitted very nicely. It's generating a lot of debate, some uh, controversy, perhaps the apostrophe, the fact that it's going on this uh, historical <laughs> uh, wall. So what's your take on things? I appreciate the fact that people are annoyed about the fact that it's going on a historical building and this is probably not what those people would want on the side of a historical building. However, we're only painting over what's already been painted. You know, we're not touching any of the building that hasn't been painted. And yeah, basically we're just giving it a fresh lick of paint. Might not be the colour they want. And you know, at the end of the day, it's, it's paint. If you don't like it, you can paint over it. It's like, no big deal. The artist is confident Gibraltar would benefit from being a street art venue and destination. Basically, people are interested in street art. It generates revenue. You know, it generates tourism and those tourists will come here, you know, and spend money and stay in hotels, go to restaurants, go to cafes. So it will generate money and it will be another interesting thing for people to do aside from see the monkeys. His passion is evident, with Ben having worked in the industry for over two decades. Known as a pioneer in the exploration of graffiti letter forms, he still hopes to generate reaction. It is a reactionary type of art, but the reaction that I get nowadays is 99% positive. You know, you know, come down and have a look at this when it's finished. It can only make you feel happy. You know, it's not offensive, it's not ugly. It's, you know, it's happy graffiti. I spent 20 years doing graffiti and annoying people and generally making things look ugly and spent the last 15 years making people happy and brightening up the world, so, yeah. A modern image on a historical building. The mural here at Inces Hall Theatre has certainly been at the heart of discussion, generating debate. Whether you like it or not, primarily down to taste. But one thing seems to be for certain. It's definitely drawn the spotlight to Gibraltar's art scene.